Thank you, Chair. And first of all, let me to say thank you for Katarina for his outstanding work with the, uh, uh, with the file. Palm oil is clearly one of the major uh, drivers of tropical deforestation and it has uh, not only climate related uh, problems but also its disastrous effect on biodiversity and also it has some human rights uh, issues including land grabbing and uh, forced eviction of uh, indigenous people. So that um, makes it clear that for the EU there is some uh, things to do. The EU is uh, the world's largest importer of embedded deforestation and also one of the biggest uh, uh, markets for palm oil uh, globally. Uh, we Greens, in line with the, the report, believe that there is a clear need for a fully sustainable palm oil supply chain by 2020. Also, we call the Commission to come up with an action plan on palm oil. Uh, there is a need for a comprehensive sustainability criteria for palm oil uh, uh, products. Uh, also, with an independent uh, auditing and monitoring of the certification uh, uh, schemes. In the long term, we also need a mandatory certification scheme for palm oil in the, in the EU and also binding commi commitments in particular uh, in anti-deforestation uh, anti guarantee in trade and development cooperation agreements with producing countries. Uh, altogether, uh, I think that uh, also we have to go beyond uh, palm oil as there are other issues of deforestation as well and we call the Commission to come up not only the palm oil action plan but also with the deforestation action plan as soon as possible.